it's Kareembo back with another epic awesome video okay uh, today we're gonna be talking about the Spongebob thing if you don't know what the Spongebob thing is uh, Nickelodeon tweeted out like a couple days ago or maybe even yesterday from if, if I upload on the same day I record it which probably isn't gonna happen but Nickelodeon tweeted out or announced that Spongebob is apparently gay now you might be asking, what? Well, why would they do that? What? How? How is he gay? Oh well, you see, you don't, you, you don't seem to recognize that it's June, or Gay Pride Month. So it's it's a uh, Gay Pride Month where all the LGBTQ plus can't forget the plus. They announced they are prideful of their sexuality, and yeah. So usually around this time, big companies they they change their logo logo usually to like rainbow instead of using their brand colors they just use like a rainbow for their logos on social media and stuff like that for like June and that's usually all they do they'll like do like a little announcement or whatever or just like tweet out something They're like oh yeah it's gay pride month guys we, we love the gays so like they're socially acceptable but so that's what they usually do like for example Xbox instead of having green for the logo for the month, they'll make it rainbow on social media, whatever. Not not they don't make it like a big thing, but they do kind of like suck up to the gays for June, like most companies do. So Nickelodeon, they're they're in their little meeting. They're like, hmm, what what, sh what should we do to appropriate to raise awareness for uh, LGBTQ plus people? Well, you know, one person's like, oh yeah, why don't we just change our logo like every year? He's like, oh, we already did that, Joe. Come on, man. You gotta do something big. No one, that no other company would do. Okay, something epic. Epic. I mean epic, okay, Joe? One guy was like, you know what? Hey, you know SpongeBob, right? Well, yeah, of course. It's like our biggest thing. We've been, it's been a thing for what? Like, a, like almost two decades now, man. Keep up. Of course I know what SpongeBob is. He's basically our mascot. He's like, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So, hear me out. So, you know how Spongebob is like super flamboyant and happy and all the time? Why don't we just make him gay? And all the execs were like, oh, that's perfect. Yeah, just make just make Spongebob gay. Okay, so that's that's the gist. Spongebob's gay now, apparently. Uh, I'm, I'm not gonna... I'm, whenever I think of Spongebob, I'm not gonna think of, oh, Spongebob's gay. I'm just gonna think, oh, it's Spongebob. It doesn't really, it doesn't add much to him. They just want him to be gay. So it's just like, it doesn't add anything to his character or anything. He's just gay now. Which is kind of stupid. If you're going to make someone gay, then at least give a reason to it. Don't make it like their whole, like, personality, but make it something a part of their character instead of just be like, oh yeah, he's gay. Like, Nickelodeon's like J.K. Rowling, this Rowling, Rowling, I don't know how to pronounce it, whatever. You know, the creator, the author of Harry Potter. Yeah, it's, it's, they're like they're like that now. Oh yeah, Dumbledore's gay, by the way. Just, just gonna throw it out there. Like no, no, th there's no hints that m maybe one someone would even think that Dumbledore's gay. He's just gay now, which is weird. People sh shouldn't just like do exposition drops after their story has been already told, just like out of context and like not even in publish. So that's kind of stupid, just adding like story bombs in when your story's already over. Back to the Nickelodeon. I mean, at least their SpongeBob is still going. Unless they make like a, um, I guess an episode about it. Which, I mean, sure, kids should be exposed to this stuff. Because it's, it's becoming a big thing nowadays. But SpongeBob, you can't just have a 20 year old character in, in your show, the main character of your show, that's been a thing for 20 years. And just suddenly be like, oh yeah, he's gay, by the way. You can't just do that, okay? So whenever I think of Spongebob, I'm never going to think he's gay. I'm I'm just going to pretend this never happened. Not because I don't like the idea of Spongebob being gay, or I have something against gays, or anyone of the, the alphabet. I just can't see him like that. Okay, yeah, he's flamboyant and happy all the time, but that's because he's supposed to be like a role model for these kids. Like, oh yeah, always have a positive mind, be creative and stuff like that. Like, the rainbow is because creativity, not because he's gay, okay guys? So, yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna, th plus, another thing, 
why I probably won't recognize him as gay or just forget about that is that um Steven Hillenburg, the creator of SpongeBob, I forgot when he died. It was like a couple years ago, maybe like a year or two ago, maybe even three. I don't even remember. But he he passed away. Rest in peace. But uh now Nickelodeon. They have fully have creative freedom over the series. And they can do whatever the fuck they want. They could, for all we know, everyone in Bikini Bottom's gay. Okay, maybe those uh, SpongeBob Squidward fan arts, which I do not want to even look at, but I guess now I have to, because I have to put it up for the video. You've probably already seen it, but maybe those are canon. You never know, because I don't know. They can do whatever they want now. Steven Hillenburg is not there anymore to be like, yeah, no, Sponge SpongeBob isn't gay. But now Nickelodeon has the full rights because Nickelodeon, you have to realize that they're a big corporate company. They don't, they just do what's best for the money. So if they can get some quick cash by sucking ass, sucking up to the gay community, then they'll do it. Why not? It's money, quick cash. So. I'm taking it less as a character, a character trait, and more of a greedy bliss business ploy by a big corporate company, and less of a creative decision. So that's my take on it. Hashtag, okay, SpongeBob is not gay. I don't know. Okay, actually, maybe not. Lots of shits going on this year. Maybe saying protesting against Spongebob not being gay. Now that might stir something else in the pot that may have not already, may not have been awoken unless that would happen. So I'm just going to leave it there. Uh, remember, gay is okay. I have nothing against the LGBTQ plus community. Just, I'm not a big fan of the Spongebob part, you know. But that's all. Uh, hope you liked the new avatar. It was pretty cool, right? Haha. <laughs> Don't have a lot of poses for it yet. But, yeah. Um, make sure to like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. The, the Minecraft penis video is coming out soon. I just wanted to make this quick video. Peace.